This is a walkthrough of the Warbly account creation process. So head over to the warbly.io website. Under the check snapshot, you can type in your account names. If you have multiple EOS accounts, check all of them and the one with the biggest balance is probably your best one to claim for the share drop. If you do the share drop in the first week, you'll get an extra 10% bonus. So get your registration done now. Once you've decided which account to use, hit the join Warbly, enter your email address. Agree to the terms, click join. Then you're gonna have to head over to your email account to verify your address. Once you're into your email here, click on the verification email. Now you can set your password. One note on the password, it does have to have an upper case letter. It can include numbers. You'll see here the first time I didn't put an uppercase and it popped up the memo here. All right, now you can sign in using your email on the password you just created. Okay, once you're in Warby, you'll see the application pop up here. Submit documents is the first step to get your KYC done. Hit select documents. I used a uh, driver's license. You're going to need a picture of your front and back your driver's license. The front goes up first. Confirm. Now you upload the back of the driver's license. Confirm again. After the driver's license, you need a selfie picture. Make sure it's a clear picture, in focus, in a bright lit room. Once these three documents are uploaded, you should see the KYC verification complete pop up here. And that's all you have to do for the KYC. So head back to the portal and fill in your personal information, your name, your address, phone number, and your birthday. Once that's complete, you can hit the uh, save application form. Review that everything you entered is correct here. Just double check everything. And then hit submit application. This process may take a couple of minutes, so just be patient. Once it's complete, it'll take you to the status page. You can hit check status right away and mine was instantly approved. It does take up to 48 hours for some people to get approved. So um, I'm out of the United States and it, it instantly approved. Now it takes you in here and you can create your account name. It doesn't tell you this, but you have to create a 12 character account, just like a normal EOS account. It will have a um, uppercase at the beginning. Don't worry about that. It's just a glitch in the, in the setup process here. Uh, but make sure it's 12, 12 uh, character account name with just letters and numbers. So now you have to head over to Scatter to create a new key pair. So head into the vault there. I name this account Warbly. 
so as not to get confused with other accounts. Hit create new. So this is very important. You have to save this private key. You basically created a brand new account. Save that EOSIO private key. Copy it to the clipboard. Open up a notepad is what I do. Paste it in there and get that thing off your computer as fast as possible. Don't store this on your computer. Store it on a uh, USB drive and back it up, please. So have multiple USB drives, back up the key. Never show this key to anyone. This is your private, private key for your Warbly account. Now that you've saved your private key, just go ahead and click uh, go back. Go back one more time and go back one more time. Hit the show public keys. That'll be your public key right there, the first one. Click on it, it'll copy it to your keyboard, your uh, clipboard. I just put input that in the active public key and you put it in the owner public key just double check that they're the right ones and they match I recommend copying your account name saving it somewhere now hit apply for account your account has been successfully created. So that's all it took. Now we have a successfully created Warbly account. You can head over to the Warbly Blocks Explorer here. There'll be a link down below. Type in your account name. And you can search for it and boom. It'll show you have your active account on the Warbly blockchain. That's creating a Warbly account. If you have any questions, feel free to jump in the Warbly Telegram channel. There'll be a link down below for that as well. And they're very good at answering any questions you have. This is all for now. The share drop portion is coming later, so stay tuned for that. Once the uh, share drop portal is open, we'll do an additional video on how to claim the share drop. Please hit the subscribe button below. And don't forget to vote for your favorite 30 EOS block producers.